this video, we're going to take the equations we've learned so far for heat conduction and put them in uh, cylindrical coordinates. So let's start with Fourier's law and Cartesian coordinates. How do we convert this to cylindrical coordinates? Well, we need to think back to how those cylindrical coordinates are defined. We can convert r uh, or x to r cosine angle phi, where r is in the radial direction and the angle phi is in the circumferential direction. Then we can convert y to r sine of angle phi, and of course z is really easy. And substituting uh, into Fourier's law those uh, substituting into Fourier's law those Cartesian coordinates, and then doing a little derivation of those x, y, and z components that are now in terms of r, phi, and z terms, we get Fourier's law in terms of cylindrical coordinates. And if we do the same thing to the heat conduction or diffusion equation, we get the heat conduction equation in terms of cylindrical coordinates. So um, easy peasy, no worries about having to memorize this. You'll be given the equation. The hard part is knowing what to do with it. Um, so we'll work some problems in cylindrical problem or in cylindrical coordinates the next time we meet. Thanks for watching. Let me know if you have any questions.